everyone and welcome back to my channel my name is Rachel Ray and today I have some happy mail this is the spring mystery box from enablers outpost as you can see well it's, <laughs> it's the end of spring now but uh, this has been waiting for me to open and I am super excited to share what's in here with you all I saw enablers outpost had made a post on their Facebook group talking about how they wanted to try something new and I jumped in on it right away. So let's see what's in it. Right now they're actually going to be making a Halloween version of this. So please check out their Facebook group so you can learn more about it. But here it is. Oh, all right. <laughs> Look at this beautiful confetti. I love it. So inside here, it says, uh, no spoilers, please consider our international friends and hold off on posting any mystery box photos until after April 25th. It's the 28th as I'm filming this. So yay. I have not been spoiled. Thank goodness. I almost got spoiled, but it was, it was well after the date. So here's a thank you card. This is beautiful. Rose gold. Love it. Ooh, stickers. Hi, Rachel. Thank you for being a part of our crafty family. We hope to, you enjoy the contents of this mystery box. Edward and Elizabeth. Thank you. Thank you for the beautiful stickers. Oh, look how beautiful they are. Love it. Love dahlias. All right. Let's see. <gasps> look at that ribbon. Oh, my gosh. Ooh, it's very deep. Okay. Let me get this out. <laughs> oh, how pretty. Oh, I love it. So that is the box inside the box. Beautiful. All right, let's 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 get inside. Are you ready? <gasps> Ooh, look at that presentation. Oh my gosh, I love it. Oh my goodness. All right, let me just make sure that you're not getting blinded by my ring light. Ooh. All right, so we've got some candy. Dum Dums, Bunny Pops. We've got some beautiful fake flowers. These are... What are these? Pet petunia? Violet? I don't know. I don't know. We're going to keep them down there. How about that? Something pretty to look at. A ring pop. Heck yeah. I want James to, to have that. He's going to like that a lot. We've got some pouches. We've got some more candy. Cotton tails. That's cute. Mini white cheddar cheese balls. Never tried them before. Oh my gosh, bubble eggs. Oh goodness, those bring me back. How cute. Ooh, we have a, a dish. This is like a resin dish. You could put your trash drills in here. You could put anything you want in here actually. Um, but yeah, I think that would go well for diamond painting. You could just put any of your trash in there. That's cute. We've got, ooh, what's this? Oh, it's a drill tray. Ooh, look at that. It's double-sided. And we have some of these rose gold tips. Oh, how adorable. Thank you so much. It's a four-placer and a single-placer. I don't know if you're able to see that. Very nice. So we've got those. And this beautiful, like, leaf, double-sided with funnel. 3D printed trays. That's a good idea. Very cool. I want to see what's inside this bag. Let's open it up. There's so many goodies in here. This is totally worth the price that I paid. I'm going to have to find out how much that was, but this is amazing. There's so much in this box. All right, what's in here? Oh, looks like candy. Lots of candy. Look at that. Oh my goodness. As an expat, I really appreciate this because I can't get these. <laughs> We've got those Lifesaver mints that I love. Kisses. I think that's a peanut butter cup. I might be wrong. Cadbury eggs. We've got some little Haribo uh, gummies. We've got a Lifesaver pop. I don't think I've ever had one of them. And this Cadbury caramel. Yay, more candy. <laughs> I'll put that over there. Then we've got this box with a really fun string. What's 
what's in here. <gasps> no way! Oh my gosh, how? So this is their logo on a cookie. It's a sugar cookie. I'd feel so bad eating this though. <laughs> that is so neat. I didn't even know you could do that. How oh, cool. Cookie bouquets. Adorable. That is so sweet. I love it. Ooh, we've got gems. Oh, that's heavy. That's heavy. Enablers gems. So they, they branched out and they're doing not only diamond painting pens, they're doing their own like diamond painting wax, putty, and they're selling these gems so that you can enhance your diamond painting. These are fuchsia. I need to try to get you so that you can see that color better. That is beautiful. Why is my phone? My phone is like, no, I can't focus. That's too much hollow. Fuchsia, lilac, gorgeous, blue bonnet, hydrangea. These are all spring themed. Princess rose. A, B, that's another crystal, and hyacinth. Wow, that is so pretty. Gorgeous. I love the colors in those. That's amazing. What else we got? We got so much. Look, it's another Oh Snap Crafters Cafe. I got one of these last year. These are awesome because you can actually open this up and put your own scent on it. Ooh, and it is pre-scented. Oh, that smells so good. Enjoy the lemon scent. So this is lemon. Look at how beautiful that is. She's put these rhinestones inside the butterfly. And it smells so fresh. That is incredible. I'm going to pop that where you can see it. We've got two of these purple tweezers one of them is curved the curved ones are really fun for placing diamonds so i would recommend trying it if you haven't already but it's cool that we're getting more tweezers too just in case because they do kind of you know bend out of shape and stuff and fun colors we like fun colors Ooh, these are okay this is a lip gloss and this is an eraser that's too pretty to use as an eraser. I'm sorry. Look at it. That is so pretty. Aw. A little strawberry shortcake over there. And we've got this lip gloss. I am curious. How does this work? Open this up. Ah! Wow! Ooh, that, that is so satisfying to look at. That's really neat. Ooh, and it smells good too. Mmm, smells like candy. Very cool. That's awesome. What else we got? We got this. This is... I don't know. I've never seen this before. Let's see. What does this say? Tig's Creations. Love the guard. Love the unicorn. Where imagination comes to life. This is a cover minder. Ooh, it's a 3D printed cover minder. So we've got a cute little ladybug. Ooh, and a really strong magnet. <gasps> They've actually printed the magnet and it's inside. How cool. That's really strong as well. Yay, we've got another cover minder. Nice. I'm going to have to check out their store. And here we've got a coaster. Oh, <gasps> what? Oh, I love this paper, but I'm ripping it. Oh my gosh. That is so freaking pretty. Look at all that hollow inside. Oh, very nice. Who made, did Tig make this as well? Oh, that's beautiful. I love it. Yep, that's going on the desk. <laughs> That'll be on the desk as well. And then we've got here a pen tray. Oh, 
I love I love the paper. Whoa, that is neon. I love it. Oh, that's cool. It's cool. It's got it's got these little bees in it and the butterflies, but it's also like almost 3D. I don't know if you're going to be able to see that really, but like they're they're up off of the pink. It's not set right on the pink, which means that it like kind of looks like they're floating and it's so pretty. That is incredible. I love it. I, I love it when people do things with resin. It's so pretty. Then we got a few more things before we get to the to the pen. We've got some washi tape. And she gave me cherry blossom washi, washi tape. Thank you so much. I love it. We've got this. Is this one of those cutter things or is this a pen pen? Let's see. Because if this is a cutter, this is my first one. What does it, what does it do? <gasps> They're snips. Oh my gosh. Yes. Oh, that is so cool. Okay, I'm a nerd. All right, so it looks like a pen. It's got the little thing. You can clip it on whatever you want, but then you open it and it's like, pshing. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. I love it. That is a really neat accessory. I like that a lot. <laughs> Thank you so much. And what else we got? We've got one more thing before the pen, which is this ruler bookmark. Oh, that's pretty. You know what? This would be really good um, on the outside of your painting just to line it up on the edge so that you, when you place your square diamonds that you don't go over the edge. But if you're also a reader, you can use it as a bookmark. That is really, really cool. Love thing. Oh, and it says it's a shaper too. Uh, this is Korean, by the way. It says um, Nun Gyeomja, which is ruler. Moyangja shaper and bookmark. Bookmark. You can trace out the shapes if you want in your journal. So cool! So cool! All right. Now, this is a Flower Girl blanks. If you don't know, I love Flower Girl blanks. They are so pretty. And this is the pen. <gasps> it's so pretty. Let's look at it up close and personal cute little bag for it oh my goodness look at those beautiful flowers inside <gasps> they are adorable I love the colors together the light blue the purple look at that this um, is like an abalone or an abalone style I believe a little bit of clear so that you can see the middle bit so beautiful. I know that these are really hard to pour, so I really enjoy the, the skill that goes into that. That is beautiful. And the thickness of this pen. So Edward turns these pens and they sit so well in the hand. It really helps to relieve the tension. If you're using a smaller pen, you're likely to grip it a lot harder. But with these, you don't have to grip as hard because it's thicker. And Edward and Elizabeth at Enablers Outpost are really well known for their thick pens, which this very much is a thick pen with two C's. I love it. Let's just bring all this beautifulness into the shot here. Hopefully YouTube will help me to show you all this gorgeousness. I love it. Thank you so much. This is a beautiful box. This pen in and of itself would cost almost as much as all of these goodies. It's totally worth it. And I love the big surprise, you know, having something that you don't know what's coming in the box, but you're going to love it. I, I like that a lot. I like that aspect of these mystery boxes. And look at all these goodies. Thank you so much. There's so much goodness in this box. I can't wait to see your Halloween box as well because it's just going to be so much fun. 
Uh, thank you so much to Edward and Elizabeth for putting this together. Totally worth the money that I spent. I am over the moon happy. Now I got to find a place in my room for all these good goodies, but that is the least of my problems. I hope you'll check them out over on Facebook and Etsy and uh, just see what they have to offer. Maybe give them a favorite over on Etsy and uh, follow their Facebook group for more updates on when their next boxes are coming. Thank you so much for watching this video as well. If you liked it, please don't forget to give me a thumbs up and subscribe for more diamond painting content. And I will see you all soon in my next video. Take care, everyone. Bye.